what is up bray gang you guys already know what it is it's your boy back at it again with another banger and as you guys can clearly see from the title yes dax just dropped a song two hours ago titled no cap now um if you know anything about dax he is a very talented artist <laughs> i said artist artist from canada and he's kind of been in some beef with a few artists and whatnot he's been clout chasing even though he doesn't really have to because he does have a mass 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 following but i do have to say he's very very talented and i respect his grind heavy there are a few other people that are trying to sort of kind of like, you know, ride his wave a little bit. But, you know, that's neither here nor there. We're going to check this out. And one thing I, I, I honestly appreciate about his music, which is why I'm so hyped to see it and view it and whatnot, especially his music videos. I mean, I've only seen music videos from him. It's definitely the fact that most of his videos, if not all, have a storytelling aspect to them. And that's what kind of captivates my attention and stuff. And I'm pretty sure that's what grasps a lot of other people's attention as well. So without further ado, if you guys haven't already and you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that red button. So. Uh, we can get this channel to 100k as fast as humanly possible if you have any suggestions for future content go ahead and recommend me some suggestions in the comments down below because i will be delivering left and right so uh and let's go ahead and get into this and see what we got going on today what the hell he has lightning bolt earrings that's a nice car i can almost bet you that's his car <laughs> Let me guess, the officer walking up to his car is Dax in a police uniform. <laughs> How did I know? Yep. License and registration, please. Yes. <laughs> officer, what I do? Shut up, nigga. That's right, it doesn't count if I don't say it all at once. License and registration, please. Can you at least tell me what I did, though? I said, shut up! I know who you are. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, wow. Routine traffic stops. Who would have guessed, right? <laughs> like, that hasn't happened to me before. <laughs> You're that rapper, Dax. There's a warrant out for your arrest. For what? For not being like the other rappers. Now, get out of the car. <laughs> yes. Yes, he just keeps getting better. Yes, I like he. What he does is definitely different. Definitely different. You gotta respect that man. Come on, I said, get up. I mean, me personally, I've never been about the internet beef. It's just not for me. That's actually the one thing I do respect a lot from him, man. Um, by the way, there's going to be a lot of pausing, so if you guys are already irritated at this point, you need to go watch the original video and quit tripping over reaction videos. I'm just letting y'all know. Anyways, um, yeah, one big thing that I do respect from Dax is how he handled the beef at Tory Lanez. So, he was just throwing a diss track like every other rapper was throwing disses at, you know, Tory Lanez because Tory Lanez said he was hot shit, blah, 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 blah. And then Tory Lanez happened to catch Dax at a concert and allegedly tried to jump him and stuff like that. And uh, he forced Dax to apologize, and Dax kind of broke it down. He's like, hey, man, like, I was low-key in fear of my life, so I'd rather just apologize than, you know, try to play this whole tough guy act and get clapped up. I mean, in the last year alone, we've lost several artists, man, XXX, Tentacion, Lil Peep, and several, and Nipsey Hussle, several other artists, man. One, to, uh, to obviously to overdosing, and the other two to gun violence, and that would be super stupid. It would be incredibly stupid of Tory Lanez to do anything to him, but... I respect the move that Dax made because I know a lot, not a lot of people would have done what he did. They would have tried to get all macho and, you know, whatever, and, instead of using their noggin. So I do respect that a lot, man. Mm. That's an Audi. That's an Audi R8, isn't it? Is it? R8 or R7? I can't even see the emblem, bro. I cannot see the emblem. No 
I know this has nothing to do with the video, what I'm about to say, but it has to do with the car. So I do look at Audis and all those other vehicles and whatnot, blah, blah, blah. And people were asking me, like, yo, like, if you could have any dream car you want, what car would you want, blah, blah, blah. I honestly don't have a dream car because I hate cars. That's a fun fact about myself. I absolutely hate cars. If I, if I could do without them, I would, honestly. I would use public transportation and that would be it. But, uh, yeah, Audis, dude, I honestly don't like them too much. I love the designs. I love what they, they're they capable of. I just don't like the fact that they're not easy to work on and then the insides of the car aren't easily accessible. So, I mean, if I wanted to go do some routine maintenance in my car, I can't really do that because it's a German car and everything is completely fucked. So, um, yeah, just a little spiel because I know everybody gets hype about these fancy cars and stuff and they don't really think about what happens when you need an oil change or what happens when you need to do something super simple and you have to pull a thousand teeth because you bought an expensive vehicle that is not built like every other vehicle and stuff it's just something to think about you know <laughs> So he's basically saying everybody's like, you know, everybody's out here like tweeting, be beefing and everything. He takes it to the to bars. Like he, ta he takes it straight up to like, you know, rap verses and everything. He doesn't have any any kind of like problem and everything with that. And definitely uh, he'll he'll go toe to toe with anybody. But he is not about to go and physically get into any altercations with anybody and jeopardize his career. Because as you can see, it's gotten several people in some unfortunate spots. So I respect that. Woo. Hey. Hey. Mm. Doesn't this sound weird when a Canadian swears? I mean, they're like the nicest people. So, like, when they swear, it's kind of like, what the hell? I, I think that a, a planet just fucking split in half. Like, holy shit. <laughs> Woo. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, that's a that's facts, man. It's crazy. The people who sneak this the most, man, they sneak this the most. The people that lurk the hardest, which is so crazy. It's like, oh man, this dude ain't shit. Blah blah blah. All of a sudden, the dude that you thought wasn't shit starts blowing up, and you're like, damn man, how'd you blow up? You ask him for all kinds of advice, man. It's so ironic, and it happens in every every aspect of life it could happen at work you could ha you could be shitting on the dude that everybody's talking shit about and then all of a sudden that guy becomes your boss and you try to get ask for advice from him and ride his little wave and <laughs> i'm just i'm just saying be careful what kind of energy you put out in the world man it definitely comes back full circle and if, if even if it's not from the same person you will get that same energy back it's just that's just the way life goes bro he made a really good point right there Ooh. Ooh. Dang. Hey. Hey, this is dope, man. This is dope. This is like some Final Cut Pro style editing, man. Because I know like there's a there's there's a trick where you can actually have yourself. You can duplicate yourself in a in a video and whatnot, which is super dope. Um, I think I can actually do that with myself, to be honest. I just have to space myself out properly. But this is this is actually pretty legit, man. Hey. 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 No capping, man. No capping. He's spitting straight facts. He's trying to let y'all know he's not here for the games. He is not here for the games. He's just trying to secure his bag and move it on. Move on. <laughs> Hey, he hit that shit. It's Dax. 
<laughs> That's his tagline, man. That should be like a new producer tagline. It's Dax. <laughs> Daphip.com. <laughs> hey. Oh, he's doing the 6ix9ine, man. Yo, that's crazy. Yo, 6ix9ine had his own, his own dance for that song, Stupid. He had his own little dance thing, man. That's crazy. He hit that shit, too. Hey. Woo! Well, I will say that was definitely a good video. Uh, and despite what a lot of people say, actually, most people like this dude. But for the people who are talking shit about Dax and everything, I will say this. Uh, Dax's music is actually very unique. If you think about like what YouTube is, right? YouTube uh, promotes creators with original content. His content's 100% original. I mean, yeah, obviously he makes his own music, but his music doesn't really sound like anybody else. He has his own spin on his songs, his own twang kind of sort of thing. And then on top of that, he uh, he has like a storytelling aspect that not many people do. I mean, hell of people tell stories, but not in the way that he does it. So it makes it very interesting. In fact, what makes it very interesting is that when he tells his stories, he plays literally every single character in his stories. There's no other character. I mean, there's probably one video where I saw him with a second person that wasn't himself, but nine times out of 10, if he's acting in a video for his music videos, like there's gonna be like six characters and he plays all six characters. I think that's impressive. And of course, like the sequence of shots and stuff, the lyrics, everything. He's sending a message to everybody out there. So I definitely thought this song was pretty good and whatnot, and I'm looking forward to more music from him. He has a project dropping, so once he drops in a full album, we'll do an album review. I have never done an album review on this channel before, so that'll be pretty interesting because you know how UMG gets, man. They, they, they love to go copyright crazy. <laughs> but we're gonna still attempt to do an album review, and if I can't necessarily listen to the songs and you guys watch it, I can at least discuss every song and go from there. Now. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any suggestions for me for the future or for anything you want me to react to, go ahead and list them in the comments down below. Hit that red button, hit the bell, and hit the thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next video, which probably will be posted in the next like 30 minutes. <laughs> Take care, peace.